everyone, and welcome back to Let's Play Mass Effect 3 Blind. I'm your host, Lasan Faye, and I'm currently living out one of my nightmares. Okay. <clears throat> Shutting down all non-critical systems to preserve remaining power. Not sure how much juice the emergency thruster will need to get me back to the surface. Don't worry about that now. right now this is fairly linear. Getting some strange readings from the probe. Something is definitely down there. Reading the probe directly below me. Looks like the final drop. God, seriously, Chef. Like, this actually cannot take that much more pressure. See anything just yet? That looks like a reaper. That's grown into the planet. <clears throat> Found the probe. Seems intact. I'm gonna keep moving. Uh like, do you not see the reaper legs? Ridiculously slowly. Oh god. Gorgeous. Shepherd. I think we found it. happening your memories give voice to our words your nature will be revealed to us except this uh 
The galaxy's at war with the Reapers. You defeated one. Why aren't you fighting back? There is no war. There is only the harvest. Then help us stop it. None have possessed the strength in past cycles. Your own species can be destroyed with a single thought. But you are different. I have witnessed your actions in this cycle. The destruction of Sovereign. The fall of the Collectors. The Reapers perceive you as a threat. And I must understand why. Oh great, so we want to study each other. Yay, nosebleeds. Before the cycles, our kind was the apex of life in the galaxy. The lesser species were in our thrall, serving our needs. We grew more powerful than they were cared for, but we could not protect them from themselves. Over time, the species built machines that then destroyed them. Tribute does not flow from a dead race. So the Reapers were built problem, based on you? We created an intelligence with a mandate to preserve life at any cost. As the intelligence evolved, it studied the development of civilizations. Its understanding grew until it found a solution. In that instant, it betrayed us. It chose our kind as the first harvest. From our essence, the first Reaper was created. You call it Harbinger. Okay. You built that machine despite what you saw the other races experience. Why? You cannot conceive of a galaxy that bends to your will. Every creature, every nation, every planet we discovered became our tools. We were above the concerns of lesser species. The intelligence was envisioned as simply another tool. And now we all pay the price for your mistake. There was no mistake. It still serves its purpose. How did you remain hidden all this time? Our extermination is not complete. Some survived and found refuge in the dark corners of the galaxy. I am their progeny. Over the cycles, the Thrall races were controlled. Removing traces of our existence as we directed them to. In this way, our survival was kept secret from the Reapers. Today, we reach out through the fragments and watch for discovery. Fragments? You mean the artifacts we found? They provide a window into the galaxy. Tools for exploring the events of this cycle for the safety of this world. Through them, we watch, we study, and remain in the shadows. How did the intelligence defeat you? To find a solution, it required information. Physical data drawn from organic life in the cosmos. It created an army of pawns that searched the galaxy, gathering this data. There was no warning. No reason given when they turned against us. Only slaughter. Only the harvest. Tell me about the Reapers. Each harvest ends with the birth of a Reaper. Perfect in its design. Each formed in Harbinger's image. Our image. Okay. Each Reaper has the power to influence organics. Over countless cycles, this ability was refined. Perfected and gave rise to indoctrination. But what's the point of all these harvests? The intelligence has one purpose. Preservation of life. That purpose is not being fulfilled. It directed the Reapers to create the mass relays, to speed the time between cycles for greatest efficiency. The galaxy itself became an experiment. Evolution its tool. Will it ever end? Unknown. Until the intelligence finds what it's looking for, the harvest will continue. What do you know about the Crucible? We have watched its construction before. It has never been completed. Those who have tried still fell victim to the harvest. Its outcome is unknown. Okay, you made your
danger point. Will you help stop the cycle? I have searched your mind. You are an anomaly, yet that is not enough. Ugh. Wait! The cycle will continue. No! You've been watching. You know this cycle is different. We will survive. You will remain here as a servant of our needs. The Reapers will harvest the rest. You release me, no one has to be harvested. Nothing will change. The Reapers know where you are. You can't just watch anymore. You have to fight. Even if you survive the battle today, the Reapers won't stop. Ever. Release me and we have a chance to end this once and for all. earned it. Out there fighting where you should be. It is clear why the Reapers perceive you as a threat. Your victories are more than a product of chance. We will fight, but not for you or any lesser race. We were the first, the Apex race. We will survive. And the Reapers who trespass on this world will understand our power. They will become our slaves. Today, they pay their tribute in blood. works. Please don't let me hit anything on the way up. Shepard, can you hear me? She's freezing. <coughs> hey. You okay? <coughs> yeah, yeah. I'm fine. Hell of a headache. <sighs> Never do that again. Oh good, I got rid of the blood. I've got Ann Bryson on the comm. Good. Put it through. Commander, 
You feeling better? Yes, thank you. I'm doing fine. What happened? We found it, Anne. We found Leviathan. Was it worth it? No idea. I don't know. We proved it can't hide anymore. That it's a part of this war, just like us. Sounds like an amazing story. One for the history books. Well, I look forward to hearing all about it. My father would appreciate this. Knowing the truth is out there. Do not give me that stupid In the meantime, hat. Admiral Hackett has asked me to join his scientific team. We all have our part to play. I should get to it. Take care, Anne. And thanks for all your help. Shepard out. I finished reading a report. Yep. The Alliance wanted more intelligence on the Reapers. I'd say we got it. Our people will be studying it for years to come. They're already calling it the Leviathan Codex. It rewrites galactic history as we know it. Whatever else it means, it tells me the Reapers had a beginning. And maybe now we'll provide them with an end. That's one way to look at it. I guess it's the only way. So go out there and make it happen. This is a big yes, step in the right direction, Shepard. Good work. Thank you, sir. Hack it out. Oh my god. Oh my god. What? been very, very thorough. Okay, got her. The Husk Neural Map. Uh, isolating parts of the brain responsible for interpreting sensory data, their conclusions, contrast the various strengths and weaknesses of Reaper ground forces when it comes to sight, smell, hearing, and so forth. This data could be extremely useful for soldiers or citizens trying to escape and evade Reapers on occupied planets. Yep. I have not done anything uh, multiplayer or uh, anything else for a very long time. Maybe I should again. Get that prepped. But I suppose I don't need to. Considering like the sheer amount of military. Commander, you've got a new message at your private terminal. Oh god. Still kicking. From Grace Sato. Commander Shepard, just wanted to say how indebted I am to you for not just for saving my life, but for giving me a greater sense of purpose. After our ordeal securing the array base on Antaram, uh, I know I have something more than my technical experience to offer. Oh, great. Oh, okay. That didn't wind up being quite nearly as bad as my nightmare was. Still scary and creepy, but not nearly as bad. Commander? So the Reapers did not fully exterminate their creators. That suggests they are fallible even on large or long-term scales. Yep. How's the ship holding up, Edie? The envelope of mass-free space we create when we travel at FTL limits any impact of micro-collisions with ambient dust. Nevertheless, some ablation does occur at subluminal speeds. Normandy will need maintenance before the year is out. If we live that long, I will totally spring for it. Hello, Shepard. Okay. Oh, oh. Okay. It's time to go check in with everyone. I'm really scared. Oh, good. 
instead I just have the chest set. I mean, granted, yes, I got Javik from the other DLC. Okay. Hi, Boo! Oh no, don't tell me James has it. Just work my way down there. Nice to have everyone back on dry land, so to speak. You scared the hell out of me with those risky stunts, Shepard. I mean, I guess it's also part of what I love about you. You know, whenever we discover something amazing like that, I wonder what else might be out there. Or even right under our noses. Hey, Shepard. You're making me blush. Stop. Tully, are you still here? Can I have a drink with you for once? Tully's not here. I know, I could actually just use the map and check that way. Okay. Greetings, Commander. Hey, can you put Glyph back in the bow tie? I can only imagine talking to something so huge, so alien. I hope it helps against the Reapers. Me too. Feel free to look around. Feel free to look around. I don't think... yeah. There's anything new. I wonder if Chopquist reacts to that and like... We'll actually do a scan for once. Shepard, I looked over your mission report. Gotta say, it feels like we've been after these Reapers forever. From Sovereign to Leviathan, they've been a pain in the ass the whole time. But at least we're starting to see the big picture. Never really thought we'd get any answers. It doesn't change much, but it does make this war feel a whole lot bigger. Yep. Not right now. Yep. Hello, Commander. Oh, darn. I was hoping. Engineering. Yeah, and Diana, maybe don't talk about Leviathan. I have studied your human religions, Commander. Your devil and his fall. Leviathan and its kind deserve the same fate. They once unleashed a plague that has haunted all of our history to this day. I say their own hell is the abyss you found them in. One I hope they never escape from. Commander. Congratulations, you've probably read more of the Bible than Shepard has. Commander. Okay. Tully. So we have Leviathan. I hope it stays on our side. Good to see you. I'm gonna guess you don't say anything. Commander. Yep. Nothing to report. Nope. I hope I'm wrong. I really sincerely hope I'm wrong. Can't say I was happy sending you down in that submersible by yourself. Don't know why I ever worry about you. Take on ancient aliens from the deep? Sure, no problem. I used to take them on on land as well. See Mass Effect 1. Is everything okay, Shepard? 
Hello, Commander. Oh, good, he didn't. With the Leviathan on our side, maybe we pull this thing off after all. Maybe, James. At least Anne's still around to see her dad's work finally pay off. Ready when you are. Ready when you are. Okay. Ah. Oh my god. Okay, no more emails. Um. Commander? Yeah, we're leaving. It is time to get Bo. So I don't know why the game keeps sending me over here. Or keeps wanting to, I suppose. I don't know, maybe it's about... Which, all things considered, pretty minor. I do believe that I'm pretty much now at the point You're of no return. You're clear to dock, Normandy. Do you need ground transport? I need to get to the embassies. Yes, Commander. So, I'm going to try to turn in these ciphers one more time. And once more, this guy really isn't here. Your daughter's paperwork has been processed. All right, I don't think you really have anything, so. Yep, the first. Well, at least it's acknowledged that I have bought them, but, hmm. I know. I missed them. In their mission. But. Oh, oh man. Yes, it was. Spectre status recognized. Uh, please select the destination. One moment, That'll please. get me close enough. Now arriving at docking bay D24. Because I need to go to my apartment. Because that's what we do. Uh, you know, actually, so I, I don't see the point in doing all the loading screens to go up to my apartment and back down. So I'm going to go ahead and end this episode right here. I want to thank you all so much for tuning in. And in the meantime, in between time, take care, have fun, happy trails. <laughs>